Come this way. Stinks, doesn't it? Yes. Uh, what was that? Buffalo. Been, uh... And who killed it? I'm not sure if it just fell over. It smells like it's been lying in the sun all day, so it might have just fallen over. Yeah. Of, of uh, They do get to uh, pick up a lot of diseases. So. Snake could have been snake bites. Could have been, it could have been all sorts of things. Could have been the hyenas themselves that killed it. Right. Look at them. Look at them go. They just don't have to quickly. Thank you. With that much of a feast, wouldn't it have drawn in more hyenas? Apparently there were a lot more around here a few minutes ago. Okay. So they're in and out. Copy, thanks Fred, I'm just here in Newington, uh, main bank now. They all look like he's grinning. Don't they? They always look like they're grinning, I think. Yeah, they, they are the, the spotted hyenas, the laughing hyena, but the, the laughing sound that they make is a submissive sound. They make when they're on a kill like this, and uh, a more dominant individual is beating up a, a less dominant individual. The less dominant individual will, would make that laughing sound. It's a submissive sound, mm. uh, letting okay. the dominant individual know that it is being submissive. What do they do when submissive. they're not being submissive? They bark? Uh, they whoop. Ooh. They They make a whooping sound. Mm -hmm. Their, is, their, their whoop is a location call, the laugh is a submissive call, and then they've got all sorts of whines and growls and stuff as well. I think there were four when we turned up and we ran away. One keeps with his back over there. Yeah. They, yeah, they're watching. Okay. Yeah. They would. Oh well. You can see that's where the, the stomach was there. It's been opened up and finished. Right, they didn't need that tree. Yeah, getting, getting upset with one another there. Now that you see that they have eaten the meat, the majority of the meat on this carcass. It's just been there and they haven't started crushing the bones. If it's something else had eaten, they would have. Anything else would have eaten the meat. The hyenas would have been left with uh, only having to crush the bones to get to the marrow. Uh, the bones haven't even started to be crushed here, which means the hyenas have got most of the meat themselves. Exactly. She's found the stomach there. Hmm? Should they have eaten this morning? Yeah. They, well, they've probably been eating all day. Oh, wandering off with the stomach there. Look at that power. That's still a heavy carcass. So they grind on the side, like scissors. Yes, yeah. All the, all the predators, their their teeth on the side, instead of having crushing molars like we have, they have what they're called carnassials. And they're arranged. 
They're arranged like a pair of scissors. <laughs> and uh, that gives them the ability to cut through the skin and uh, all of that. And you'll see, they, they do exactly do that. They cut with the side teeth and they rip with the canines at the front. So they don't chew their food. Do they regurgitate it for the pups or something? If, the, if they go back to the den, if there are uh, cubs at the den, they do regurgitate just like the wild dogs do. They are very, very good family animals. They look after each other very, very well. Now, this sighting we've got here of dirty, smelly hyenas, this is what gives hyenas a bad name, the fact that they do get dirty and smelly like this. They're extremely efficient at what they do. They're extremely strong, they're extremely powerful, they're extremely good hunters, they're very efficient scavengers, but they look ugly like this, so yeah. therefore they get a lot of bad press and they get blamed for a lot of things that doesn't actually happen. In some areas, lions will scavenge more from hyena kills than hyenas will from lion kills. Oh, really? So all the big predators scavenge. It's, it's not only the hyenas that do it. The documentary is about the hyenas itself. If it's about something else, the hyenas are the bad guys. You watch a documentary about the hyenas, at least they'll tell you the story of the hyenas. But uh, more watchful now about They're pretty heavy. How much do they weigh, you think? A, a big hyena, probably 80 kilos. Mm -hmm. mm, one of the flies, obviously, 